Hello friends, welcome back. Before we start this video, and to subscribe to our channel if you haven't subscribed yet. We'll keep sharing training videos, tricks, sample backup, and many more things. This video is basically designed for beginners of Logo PLC, and I will demonstrate here how to add blocks, align, add message text, and add block name commands, and how to simulate this logic, upload download, and limitation in uploaded backup. I will be creating a simple logic to start and stop a pump that is set and reset output based on input 1 and input 2. Input 1 will start and input 2 will stop. Creating a network project, you can define IP address of your PLC. You can change it later on as well. Okay. And uh, taking input 1. And the next click will automatically add the next input, input 2. And latching relay to set and reset. Input 1 will set, and input 2 will reset. And now let's align these blocks. Go to edit, align. You can also make this equidistance and you can give the distance parameter here okay now let's add output Now we'll connect this uh, connector to the open connect block. It is always a good practice to not keep any unused output as open. And now we will add a message text. We require this message text block. This block required enable bit. So we'll use uh, this always high bit. So it will always keep showing you this block value on our logo screen. And again, we'll connect this to open connector. Now let's add some text to our block. Test project. You can give any anything as per your requirement. And pump. You take this on and off status, and it will change based on our output value, digital output Q1. Okay. You can also just click and drag and relocate if required. Okay. Now let's save it. Let's give any name. Test project. Let's check in the simulation. It will be exactly same on your PL logo PLC screen as you can see here. Input 1 will start and input 2 will stop. So off. Okay, perfect. Now let's add some comment. You can add from here, insert command, and the shortcut is F9. 
you can also use shortcuts okay start and stop logic now let's uh, put this below this logic this logic here and a new command text display block okay save it now some blocks you they have property like they you can assign a name so this block name this will be visible when you access your program from your logo plc front key pair and adding some comment and giving tag names for input 1, 2 and output 1. This will be a start. This will be stop. And uh, this is command. Okay, now let's download to our PLC. connection is okay it will put the com your controller in the stop mode even a small change you want to make and download will always stop your logo PLC this is exactly the same screen that you can see on your PLC and giving physical input one okay pump is on and input two will turn it off okay so this is also this is uh, about upload and download sorry uh, just download now we will upload this uh, download it back up in our PLC we will see uh, what we are getting testing connection you must know the IP address before you upload from your PLC so any upload will turn your PLC into stop mode this I have uploaded in the diagram mode so it is up uh, uploaded in uh, letter form and the network project let's uh, upload here testing connection okay again stop upload it and again putting in run mode so you can see it is beautifully uploaded here unlike there's a ladder it's uh, easy to understand in uh, network project the alignment is same that we have downloaded but uh, this command is not here block name is there and let us check about the tag name so we have also lost our tag name in our uploaded backup so these are the limitation like uh, your command is gone and the tag names that you have given is also not available in your uploaded backup i hope this video will give you basic idea about uh, starting of your logo plc project
Thank you.